Iowa City will again be in the spotlight this weekend as people from all over the world gather to watch and participate in cycling races and family fun entertainment. The annual Jingle Cross and World Cup of Cyclocross will take place Friday through Sunday at the Johnson County Fairgrounds. Come cheer on the world's best cyclists during the World Cup races, along with other amateur races. You can also take part in other great activities like the Grinch's Kid Race or the Doggy Cross. To register for activities, visit JingleCross.com. There you can also find a schedule of all races and events, a map of the course, and other information for spectators and participants. There's no cost to attend Jingle Cross, except for registration fees on some activities. Please make sure you're feeling healthy, mask up, and spread out. It's also homecoming week for the Iowa Hawkeyes. There are a variety of activities taking place all week long. You can find details at homecoming.uiowa.edu. The annual parade will begin at 5.45 on Friday in downtown Iowa City. The streets on the parade route will be closed for several hours, so make sure to plan your commute. If you're planning to attend the parade, please bring your mask and respect other people's space. The playground in the Ped Mall is going to get a new look next spring, and public input played a big role in the final design. Our Parks and Recreation Commission had more than 550 people provide input on initial designs. The overwhelming call to increase the level of accessibility resulted in this updated design. That feedback helps staff better create a play space that is fun, inclusive, and accessible to a wide range of users. Construction is planned to take place next spring. The city is also seeking public input on three other park improvement projects. Chattic Green, Court Hill, and Whispering Meadows are all due for upgrades, including ADA improvements. This month, there's going to be an open house event to discuss each park project with neighbors and gather feedback on the design plans. People can stop by at any time during the allotted hours to meet with staff. For those who cannot make the in-person events, the park improvement details will be uploaded to the city's website along with a survey for public feedback. Those materials will be available at icgov.org slash parkprojects beginning this Friday, October 15th. Feedback will be accepted through October 29th. That's all for this week. Happy homecoming to all Hawkeyes. We'll see you next time on Iowa City Update.